Hello everyone, here we are, we are in Athens, Greece and today we are taking you guys with us throughout our trip and showing you where we've been and we hope you have as much fun as we did let's go so this is one of our first days in Athens and we started exploring the city center we visited the academy we took our favorite bus uh, 6 on 608 we almost died in that bus because we had no clue that the bus was so fast and so reckless it was definitely a ride to say the least here is more of the the view we can see the classic architecture combined with you know some newer uh buildings in athens it was really cute here some dude like approached us and he started asking us for directions you will see throughout this whole vlog that random people keep asking us questions like we're locals but spoiler alert we're not so we came downtown and we're looking for something to eat we cannot find anything that has pants because we're really and we started eating the food there that day we didn't necessarily enjoy but it was still pretty good some random lady decided it was funny when she saw me that i was taking pictures of my food and she uh, felt kind of awkward as you probably can see in the video i took the video from georgiana and i started um <laughs> trying my best to film as you can see here that's probably best left to georgiana but yeah and here's the pretty lady here's georgiana look at how cute she is look at that cute smile here we are at the underground we took some clips of the ancient artifacts that are put on display there uh, they found them when they were digging for the building of the underground itself um it, i find it quite interesting and we wanted guys to have a look, so here they are. Okay, so next we are at Acropolis in Athens. This is the theater of Dionysus. Dionysus was known as the god of festivity and theater in ancient Greece. Here we are just walking around. This is the Odeon of Erodis Atticus, also known as Erodio, and is a stone Roman theater. It is used until today for a theater or musical events. Here, here is us trying to climb and not to die on the steps by falling. This is the architecture, we are finally getting up there. There were so many people, it was so crowded. But as you can see, you can see the, the old building. Um, so a lot of people confuse Acropolis and Parthenon and I just wanted to say that uh, Acropolis the highest point of the city so it's the mountain the whole parthenon is placed on top of and parthenon is a former temple uh, dedicated to the goddess athena So how do you like Greece so far, Christina? I love it so much. Like if you can see the view on that part, like I'm in love with the sky and I can see the sea and I can't wait to go for us to go to the sea. Um, I love the, the sights, it's, it's amazing. I feel lucky and happy to be in such a historical place, beautiful place. 
Uh, mm-hmm. It's gorgeous. I love it. So Christina also said that it reminds her a little bit of Eucharist. Oh yeah, not this part of course, <laughs> but the other part of Athens is familiar. It look it looks like Eucharist mm-hmm. a bit, like yeah, mm-hmm. uh, the transportation, some parts of the streets, a little bit of the metro. Yeah, it looks a little bit like Eucharist. So it's familiar. I'm not too uncomfortable or too unfamiliar with the place. Like yeah. I feel like. Uh, yeah. I was also like fascinated <laughs> with the mountains in this mm-hmm. city. I was asking to Jan all the time, what is mountains? Is that a mountain? I know it sounds kind of dumb, but yeah. I was taking everything in. Mm-hmm. So, mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, also, I was kind of um, surprised of how many ups and downs and hills are in Athens, and we, we are always had to. Yeah. We always have to take that road, you know, like yeah. go up and With down. With hills, yeah. yeah. We walk on hills every day and climbing up in Acropolis has been like the worst thing we've done so far. Um, yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's amazing out here, but like the walk under the sun, we're burning. Yeah, yeah we're crispy. Yeah. That's so shocking to me. Like, how can you've never seen oh, a palm oh. a palm tree in your life? Uh, like not a real one, just fake ones. And also, uh, mm-hmm. I'm surprised by the trees. I'm fascinated by the trees because they look beautiful. They're different kinds. Unfortunately, I'm not an expert, but they're different kinds and they look they look awesome. And also, people here in Athens on their balconies have. Huge, huge plants and a lot of plants and it looks so pretty. I love it. Check out Christina's new headpiece. I'm a Greek. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. <laughs> Now, here you can see a part where we were kind of lost. We were looking for the place where the philosopher used to meet and discuss. Uh, it was a pretty huge place and we looked over in the map, but we couldn't find it. So we walked around in the sun, in the heat, and we found it after some time, but it, it took us a while. This is the temple of Ephistos. Um, Ephistos was the god of metalworking, craftsmanship, and fire. Uh, he was married to the goddess Aphrodite, and he was considered the ugliest god. Yeah, Georgiana told me all about that ugly dude and the fact that Aphrodite was obli- obligated to get married to him how sad is that dude like what but yeah <laughs> i really enjoyed that that i got to learn that and that i saw it in real life yeah it was really cool i wish they were real like the gods and stuff we're kind of having like a discussion about where that came from and if that was real but yeah okay imagine anyway i'm rambling next 
today we are at McDonald's. It's my first time trying Greek McDonald's. I'm really curious about the taste because me and Georgiana we've made a challenge I guess to go in every country that we want to go and compare the taste. So. Of McDonald's. Yeah. Yeah. So I got a Big Mac and an ice cream. And what did you get? Um, fries, a salad, and an ice cream. <laughs> yeah, we'll let you know how it goes. Yeah. So we just finished from McDonald's, as you can see from behind us. Yeah, it was pretty good except the fries, to be honest. Uh, the taste was kind of the same. Yeah. And I like how the McDonald's now looks the same as the well, I'm a bit disappointed from the options. They didn't have any meat-free options. The, the salad I got was too frozen to eat. So I, I but, I, but instead I like the fries. I don't know why she didn't like them, so yeah. We're heading to the beach now. Here's uh, the museum where we learned more about Greek culture and we saw some artifacts. Greek message. This is pronounced Wawayo. <laughs> <laughs> Wawayo. So, Christina, where are we? Wawayo. So, last time we were here, we couldn't get in because the queue was too long. But today we're at the museum and we're gonna take a walk and some pictures of the goddess. Yeah. So Christina is dressed really, really nicely. Uh, but people still insist on talking to her in Greek. I don't know what about her speaks local. I'm the. I, I might as well, instead of this crown, have a huge sign that says tourist. <laughs> I know, right? But they still talk to me in Greek and they expect me to give them directions. Yeah. No. Yeah. The Acropolis Museum is focused on the findings of the archaeological site of the Acropolis of Athens that we were showing you earlier on in the clip. Uh, the museum was built to house every artifact found on, on the Acropolis area. The museum is also built over ruins that we'll show you later on. Um, it was founded in 2003 and its goal is to preserve the artifacts from Acropolis. Here we have the museum and we can see some recreations of how uh, the artifacts used to look like. The parts with the white are the recreations and the more yellow ones are the original ones. We really learned a lot. We also have a new video coming up about our whole experience. You can learn more about what we learned here in that video. So stay tuned for that. We also took so many pictures here because, you know, do it for the gram, I guess. By the way, I want to clarify that I know if you hear me pronouncing Greek words weirdly, I just want to say it's because I was reading Greek letters the way I thought you were supposed to read them in normal letters, I guess. Uh, yeah, whatever. So I was pronouncing it like that and kind of made a joke out of it. I promise you, I'm not an idiot. I know that's not who you're supposed to say it. I just thought it was kind of funny and Georgiana thought so too. So yeah, Huawei is actually a museum and it's not a new, it's actually an M. So yeah, museum. Yeah, we saw some more artifacts and parts of old houses and some rocks. Yay for rocks, we saw a, a lot of that. And then we skipped to eating. Hello, we are at Goodness. Uh, when I was younger, I used to call them the Great McDonald's. 
Uh, uh, it's such a shame we don't have them in Cyprus anymore. One eternity later. I'm full. I'm about to burst, but it was really good. I like had fries and some type of sandwich because I wasn't in the mood for burgers. And I'm so full. But was it good though? Yep, I liked it. How much do you rate it out of 10? Uh, uh, 8. Ooh, okay, cool. Yeah. I'm glad you like it. After we explored the city some more and in the days after that we decided that we wanted to relax for a bit so we decided to go and see a movie and we went to an outside cinema and because we are in Greece and we travel so much and so far in this cultural place we decided to get cultured and watch the Minions of course what else? It was an experience, the neighborhood was kind of... <laughs> we didn't expect it to be... Um, it was kind of shady, honestly. We don't want to offend anybody, but we were kind of scared while we were there. But <laughs> the movie was nice. <laughs> Yeah, after that we enjoyed some more of our stay there. Unfortunately, I had to leave a little bit earlier and Georgiana like the sweet, nice, amazing friend and she is. She went with me at the airport and... Um, so we are at the Turkish airport and we're waiting for the and we just say bye and stuff but we're gonna see each other more and we're gonna film everything and we're gonna post it on our channel and also stay tuned for other videos too yeah i'm going to be too soon i make that promise public and i'm gonna miss you so much I'm gonna miss you too. <laughs> fine don't watch it's private you know, we have more content on the way, uh, that was the end of our trip. We were gonna put out some more videos and stay tuned for that if you wanna see some more travel vlogs and also more of our videos, please like and subscribe. Also, we cannot wait to hear your opinion about it down below and share with us your experiences. See you next time. Bye bye!